Hey everyone, welcome to Soap Trend. We hope that everybody is doing well. We have some exclusive news to share with you all in today's video. In this video, we present you the news of our favorite TV show Young and the Restless. The comings and goings of the show suggest that Dylan McAvoy will be back after Ray Rosales exits the show. So is McAvoy really back on the CBS soap? Do watch this video till the end to know everything. The Young and the Restless comings and goings wonder if Dylan McAvoy, the character played by Steve Burton, returns as Ray Rosales. The character played by Jordi Villasuso exists in Nova City. Why would the CBS soap make such a change? It's all about pairings and who's meant to be with whom on Viner. This week, the soccer came out on the Young and the Restless that CBS ex Jordi Villasuso. The actor said he was stunned since he had inked a three year contract to stick around as Ray Rosales. But he said the network took advantage of a clause to cut him despite his renewal. And that leaves one blossoming storyline set to wilt. Remember Chelsea Newman's intent on landing Ray? She's been flirting up a storm with Sarah Newman's husband. And Chelsea is ready to scheme to get what she really wants. But Young and the Restless has to cut off this storyline since the object of her affection is leaving. With no Ray, that leaves Chelsea hanging. It won't be long until the detective's out of Genoa City. So what's his fate? Will he live dead or alive? With Chance Chancellor on unstable ground? Perhaps Ray died on duty? If Chance freaks, then it could put Ray Rosales at risk. Or the top cop might head back to Miami for a family crisis that requires his presence. So will Wayna bring back Steve Burton as Dylan McAvoy? Another question is what the soap will do as it loses the only detective the Genoa City Police Department seems to have on staff? For months now, Steve has been available to cost because General Hospital fired him. It was about General Hospital's vaccine mandate. Burton asked for but was denied a religious exemption to the vax rule at the ABC soap. But Young and the Restless doesn't have a mandate, and most COVID restrictions have ended across the country. So will Wayna bring back Dylan McAvoy? It's not a difficult task to do. It's not like he's dead. You may remember that Dylan left to go into witness protection. That's super easy to reverse. If CBS Daytime hires Steve, then they could bring back Dylan just as Ray exits. But why would the soap send out Ray Rosales and tag in Dylan McAvoy? They both have a history with two key female characters that need some love in their lives. That's both Chelsea and Saren. Have you guys recalled the past? Before Dylan married Saren, he was his to Chelsea on Young and the Restless. So he's a top choice to fill a romantic void left by Ray. You may recall that Chelsea Newman fell hard for Dylan. Even to the extent that she lied and let him think that he got her pregnant. She and Dylan married right before she gave birth to Connor Newman. Dylan annulled her after her lies came out that traumatized him. But she was crazy for him so another chance with Dylan McAvoy might just be the ticket. And Saren was married to Dylan when he left her for witness protection. She adored him and would welcome him back. However, the big question in everybody's mind is, how will the exit of Ray Rosales take place? Will he leave in a body bag or some sort of crisis with his family in Miami? But with Chance freaking out, maybe it's a death on duty as a cop if his partner fails him. Will Wayna bring back Dylan McAvoy to fill the space left as Ray Rosales exits from the show? For that, we will have to wait and watch what happens on the CBS soap opera as Jordi Velasuso leaves. So this much for today's video. We hope you liked it. We will deliver more news of Young and the Restless.